10 seconds before the gate opened, I'm telling myself that I'm the best in the world. I'm better than the bull. I'm better than anybody out there. And at that point in time, there is no competition between anything else in this world. It is you and a 2,000 pound animal. I just tell myself, you're the baddest in the world. There ain't nothing that can overcome you. And you just gotta have that mentality to make it. When I'm on a bull, the world stops turning. It seems like there's nothing else in this world that matters except for the fact that I have to overcome this beast. From the time I nod my head, it's only eight seconds. That's the blink of an eye almost. And you can't even think about it. It's all based off a of reaction. I have to have a plan going into it, whether it's working out in the weight room or it's the two hours that it takes me to get ready to nod my head. If you're not in shape with the bulls that you have to get on, you won't last long, you're, just, you're too frail, you won't make it. Outside the, the AT&T Center, the Reliant Stadium, I'm your average cowboy at day to day, ride horses, push cows around. Cowboy seems like the last of a dying breed, and that's what makes me so proud to be a cowboy, is the fact that everybody's coming into modern times, everybody's moving to the city, and uh, for me to be able to promote being a cowboy, that's that's the lifestyle I want to live, and I just hope people who see it, they realize what a cowboy means. The cow market, the horse market, the being able to rope and ride. I have three dogs I take with me every time I go work cows. I can talk to them like, probably better than I talk to you. I can ride a horse. Just things that are dying out in this world that I make of as a lifestyle. I've had a ranch hand even before I became partners with them, just because I know how much it protects my truck. You don't know if there's a deer gonna jump out. Uh, if you gotta bump a cow into the pens or whatever, you're protected no matter what. You have to be ready to take the hit. I've broken my femur, I've broken this eye socket. I have three scars on my face and I wear a, a hockey helmet for riding. Tufts, getting dirty, getting black eyes, getting stepped on, getting kicked by a cow or a calf, wiping the dust off your jeans and going right back to it.